WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials right now trading up eight points. You get the Nasdaq up 84, S&P's up 10. Gold, gold contract up $1.90, trading at 1786 an ounce. We have silver down four cents, twenty-two dollars forty-five cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up twenty-six cents, seventy-two dollars thirty-two cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. The ten-year down three ticks, trading one thirty oh seven. The thirty-year up full point plus three ticks at one sixty twenty-six. And King Dollar, King Dollar's down a half a penny, man. Uh, we're going to be see whether we uh, get some follow through here. And this is where you, you have divergence again, meaning that you have King Dollar down, gold's only up a buck ninety. Bottom line, King Dollar's down four seventy-six. You're at 95, 8.93. Euro is at 113. The yen is at 113.67. The British pound's at 132 to 1 US dollar. We get open, we take a look at the spy, what you have out here. You've had a sideways move out here today, folks, trying to push a little higher. Uh, you, you're getting there with light, light volume. It's Wednesday. These highs are probably going to be tested. That's, that's, that's how they're looking right now, because the bottom line is that you didn't have sellers out here today. We certainly don't have buyers either. Uh, bottom line is that you have uh, 473.54, no doubt can get tested. We take a look at the NDX 100, the three Qs, same type of setup inside the three Qs. The contraction in the three Qs is amazing. I mean, it's like unbelievable, actually. Um, it, yesterday, so we had the contraction yesterday. Con yesterday, you did 56 million. Well, we're at 30 now. That's saying we're going to do about 40, 45 million, and that's going against 78. And the number to keep your eye on here, inside, and it, hadn't, it didn't make it out here today, it didn't make it today, is the 40116, uh, 40119, inside of the uh, NDX 100, inside of the three Qs. Gold, gold contract out here. We take a look at the gold contract. That went sideways out here today. You had a low of uh, 1780, a high of 1794. You've done 102,000 contracts. Bottom line, my take is that you're building cars for a higher price. I expect we're going to go to this 1825 on this run. <clears throat> Excuse me, folks. And now let's get over to King Dollar and take a look at King Dollar. So if we take a look at King Dollar, what you're going to see, you get a decisive move down. Uh, bottom line is that it looks like it's going to go after the lowest swing again, which is the 95.517. My take here is that we're actually going to go back to the breakout area, to its strength. And we'll see what happens at that point. That's 94.533. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.